हेलो फ्रेंड गुड इवनिंग एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज योर होस्ट खान बाबा गॉड विल गिव यू मोर हैप्पीनेस एंड लॉन्ग लाइफ आई ट्राई टू माय लेवल बेस्ट टू गिव यू लेटेस्ट अपडेट अबाउट ए राकी दिन आर सो प्लीज लाइक एंड शेयर माय वीडियो विद योर फ्रेंड एंड फैमिली विच विल हेल्प मी फॉर स्पोर्टिंग and now let's start the today information the iraqi economy is witnessing remarkable growth which was contributed to the decline in the dollar exchange rate 1320 that's where we're at the official exchange rate if they were to adjust and drop the three zeros what's that become 1.32 to the dollar that transition can happen in a fast and furious manner the least amount of shock to the markets that's when it could occur i personally only believe it removing the three zeros means removing three zero notes from circulation not three zeros off the exchange rate to avoid the dreaded l word lop futures slide as bond yields spike to a three week high we are watching an inverted bond market We are watching the short-term bonds outbid and out-earn the long-term bonds. I was always told this is key to the reset and we are watching it live. This bond market is in shambles. I was always told to watch for this just before the reset and to watch for the HCL law to be passed in Iraq. We are now watching them as we approach the finish line. Central Bank of Iraq quote There are no current plans to print new currency. What that tells me is people don't have to worry about a lop or redenomination because in order for you to have a redenomination or a lop you have to create new currencies. It also tells me they're not creating the lower denominations which means they're going to stick with the currency they currently have. Some people see this is the glass half full. Some people look at it as the glass is half empty. There's an article that says, we're not going to come out with the the lower denominations because it won't affect the exchange rate of the Iraqi dinar. What are you stupid? I'm talking to the media. The media is owned by the far nasty side. And they don't want this to happen. They don't want anyone to know about the monetary reform success so they put out information. That a little misleading of course they're going to come out with lower denims. Remove the three zeros at value to the currency. That's what they've been telling you. This article is directly from the CBI. IMF reports its consultation. With Iraq on Article 7 for 2024. They want us to know how exceptionally things have gone. how they have changed the reserve requirements and how Iraq has already met the reserve requirements. Iraq's banks hold 18% reserves. U.S. banks only hold 2%. Banks in Iraq are much safer than U.S. banks. This is part of moving to phase two of the white papers and economic reforms. What is also in those reforms is an increase of the purchasing power if the dinar This shows the clear progress they are making. Thank you for watching my video. Take care and goodbye.